I'm going to say, I've never written a first draft that was perfect. And you're going to say, why? Okay. Okay. And then I'll give you the answer. Sure. That I give my students. Okay. I've never written a first draft that was perfect. So anyway, I, you know, I've said this to my students and they're always surprised because everyone has this notion that sometimes you just write something and it's perfect as soon as you write it. It happens. Everyone assumes that happens, that everybody gets lucky sometime. And I said to them, I have never written something in a first draft that was perfect, that never had to have any changes. And what do they say to that? No, she'll so say, why is that? Oh, that's right. Okay, sorry. Whose line is it? Um, why do they say that? No, why is that? Oh, sorry. Okay, let me try that again. <laughs> uh, why is that? This is funny. This is a, jo this is a funny joke. Uh, where you, okay. Um, let me try it. Sorry, let's, uh, why, why is that? Well, wait, no, let's, okay. uh, a little digression here. Okay. So you're going to interview me, okay? Okay. Yeah. And uh, make sure you speak loud so they can hear you. Sure, sure. You have to say, I understand you're the world's greatest comedian. Jack, I, okay. Uh, Mr. Graves, I understand that you are the world's greatest comedian? And I say, yes. Then you say, to what do you attribute your great success? Let me hear it. To what do you... Do Sorry, you're going to say yes or no? To what do you attribute? Right, but you're going to, to say your great, yes. Yeah, uh, oh, yes. Okay. To what do you attribute your great success? Good. Let's just rehearse that okay, once. Okay, let's do it again. And then we'll do it for the camera. Okay, okay. okay. All right, uh, start. Okay. You are the world's greatest comedian, Mr. Graves? No, it's I understand oh, okay. that you okay. are the world's right, greatest right, right. comedian. Okay. You got to get the lines okay. exactly right. Sure, sure. Mr. Graves, Mr. Graves, thank you for taking my question. Uh, Karen with Film Courage, I understand. You are the world's greatest comedian? Yes. Okay. To, to what do you attribute that success, sir? No. To what do you attribute your great success? Okay. To what do you, to what do you attribute your great success, sir? Great. Are you, are you ready to shoot it? Oh, I thought we already were. No, we, we, we were rehearsing right oh, now. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, sorry. No, I mean, I know he's running it, but right, this, right, is, okay. this is the joke. Okay, sure, sure. So um, have you got it down? Have you got your lines yeah, down? Yeah, I think so. I think so. I'll okay, try. Okay. okay, go ahead. Um, Mr. Graves, thank you for taking my question. Karen with Film Courage. I understand you're the world's greatest comedian? Yes. To what do you... Timing. Okay. There you go. <laughs> did you get it? I do, yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh-huh. So, um, um, I'm going to say, I've never written a first draft that was perfect, and you're going to say, why? Okay. Okay, and then I'll give you the answer. Sure. That I give my students. Okay. I've never written a first draft that was perfect. Why? Because I'm too good for that. Okay. Now, what does that mean? Oh. Many See, that's things. the thing, because uh -huh. they're not expecting that. They think that if you write a first draft, it means you're good. And I said, I never get a perfect first draft because I'm too good for that. That flips it on its head. They're going, too good? You mean if you're too good, all your first drafts are not good? I would think that if you're good, your first, some of your first drafts might be really good. But you're saying... I'm too good to have a perfect first draft. Hmm. Why do you think that would be? Oh, um, modesty? Nope, I just said I'm too good <laughs> for that. <laughs> okay. Um, delusion. What? Delusion. The, the what? Delusion. Delusional? No, no. no okay. okay. I, I, I wrote it and okay. I go, this is not perfect and I've never had a perfect first draft. I see. Um, I don't know. Because I can see where it can be improved. And the person who's not that good doesn't see where it can be improved. But I'm good. I'm too good to have a perfect first draft because I can see where it can be better. That's half the answer. The other half of the answer is, and I know how to make it better. Because sometimes you can go, mm, this first draft, it's not quite perfect. I know it needs to be fixed, but I don't know how. 
What I'm saying is I'm too good for that because one, I can always see how anything can be made better. And two, I know how to do it. So that dispels that notion that a lot of people have that if you really know what you're doing, you should be able to write that first draft and it's perfect. And I'm saying, well, no, because if you're really good, you will always see how something can be made better and you have the tools and the knowledge to make it better. You know how to do it. So again, that to me is a little paradox, which I kind of like. Because hopefully what I'm saying to my students is don't, don't think that the first draft of anything you write is going to be perfect. Because if you are really good, you will see that it can be better. And if you know how to make it better, that's, 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 that's what you want. You want to be able to go, hmm, this thing is not perfect. But if I do this, 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 and this, it'll be perfect. And so at what point does someone know where the weaknesses are? At what point do they know where the weaknesses are? Or at what point do they get to where they go, well, it's not perfect, but I'm done? The latter. Um, there's a famous saying that poets never finish writing a poem. They only abandon it that at some point you might still feel, well, it's not perfect, but enough is enough. I gotta move on to my next one, you know? So um, maybe there's always gonna be a point where you think, well, this is as good as I can make it, and you, you go on. I mean, I don't think you can say to someone, uh, there's a point where you will always know where you can make it better. And I mean, you know, we're human beings. Sometime what we send out is imperfect, and sometimes we got to go, well, that's enough. You know, I got to move on to the next thing. This is not the best soup I ever made, but it'll do. Uh, you know, there's an old saying writing is rewriting. So first drafts are usually, that's all, they're first drafts. Um, I've never written anything that didn't go through more than one draft. I, I, in other words, I've never written anything that was perfect the first time out. Now you're supposed to ask me why. <laughs>